My experience as a Wolves athlete um, has been nothing like I thought. You know, I walked on to open tryouts after being out of high school for two years, and I never thought that I'd be where I am right now. I never played middle, always played outside, and I, it's still kind of mind blowing to me. I always made jokes about playing middle, and I'm short, and I'd never play, and pff, that's that's hilarious because I I could never do that, but but I did. I got transformed into a middle in my first year. And people think that I'm successful because, oh, I jump so high. Well, I mean, partly yes, but I wouldn't be as successful if I didn't have the coaches that I have or have had in the past. Um, I never played middle ever, didn't know much knowledge about it in high school. So my coaches have taught me things that I have caught on to quickly. And that's been a really big experience as a Wolves athlete for me is learning a new position because I had been so used to playing the same position since I was in grade six or seven. Um, while learning the new position though, I've learned so many things about the game. It's kind of an unreal opportunity when you get to play more than one position in the sport that you play. You kind of get more of a, a view of the game and a perspective. And I find for me, it made things almost easier for me. Um, I kind of understood teammates better in a way because I kind of knew how they felt if that makes sense to anybody um so that in general you know that's a huge part to my Volvo experience um another thing is I have also had the I've had the opportunity to be part of some pretty amazing groups of girls you know in the past years and especially this past year we lots of women's teams tend to have you know dramatic issues and this and that but I've been pretty fortunate and especially this past year we got along well like outside of volleyball and I think that's huge when you can have a group of girls that you know they get along and they can respect each other and hang out and have fun it's it's really great experience and I find it's I don't it's more worthwhile when you can have a group of girls like that um but needless to say my experience is not over I still have my fifth year left and yeah this is the year Uh, my experience as a wolf has been a little bit different than the majority, obviously. Um, not being from Grand Prairie, let alone Canada, it was always going to be a tough move for me. Um, moving away from friends and family uh, and moving to an entirely different climate, for one, um, it was always going to be a tough go for me. But I'm glad that I was gifted the opportunity to come here of all places. I've made a huge second family that I don't believe I would have been able to have found anything near as special if it wasn't here with the Wolves. I think it's so special to be a part of the Wolves family as you really are accepted into a, a giant family. Um, and I believe that has its roots through the community. Um, Grand Prairie isn't the largest of cities, which I believe creates a bit of an open bubble around the town in the sense that everyone has everyone's back, um, including the people that aren't from the area. Um, who they are basically accepted in as if they had been there their whole life. Uh, and I think that really shows through with the Wolves program where I can walk down the hallways during school and see any one of the Wolves and I know that I can smile at them and I'll get a smile back. As well as being able to run into any coaches or admin staff such as walking past the fitness desk and seeing Dwayne and always having a chat with him in the mornings. And that feeling of community and family that the Wolves program radiates is what I believe makes being a Wolf so special and I'm really thankful for it. What I love about being a Wolves athlete is just how close-knit of a family we are. You always feel the support from other teams, the faculty, the staff, your coaches, everyone involved um, just makes you feel a part of a one, one big family and I think that's what makes our program so special. Knowing that we have so many people supporting us throughout the year really makes wearing a Wolves jersey so much more special. It puts into perspective why why we work so hard and the fact that we have such a close family of people um, in the college really really makes it worth it and it's nice knowing that 
people will work hard for you if you work hard for them and so it creates the perfect environment for us to be successful and I think the relationships and connections that we've built throughout the year are really going to be what we remember in years to come and that's what I love about our athletics and the community that we have at the college. My experience at GPRC has probably been one of the best experiences in my life. Um, when I first came here my first year, my family did not approve of me coming here and said if I come that that's it, that I'm on my own and I wanted to come to Grand Prairie so I packed up my stuff and I left. And here I am and it was probably the best decision I have made in my life coming from Edmonton and coming not knowing anyone. I had to completely rebuild my life and rebuild like what I wanted to do. Coming here I came to for school and for soccer and it was amazing. First year we came second in provincials, went to nationals, never went to nationals before coming to Grand Prairie which was really nice. In my second year we won provincials, went to nationals, didn't get the results we wanted in nationals but still that heart and that drive that pushed us to go best feeling ever the past couple years have been rebuilding but it happens we are getting strong and we will be there one day again and I'm so excited and so ready to look forward to next year um as a GPRC athlete I didn't expect this to become like a family you don't know how fast it goes and how much you're going to miss it when it's gone you become friends with people you would never expect to become friends with and I honestly can say I have a family up here and I'm so grateful for that Becoming a Wolf is special because not only do you get to interact with your teammates outside of practice, but you also get to socialize with other teams and build a special culture in the college. It is an amazing feeling playing on a cold, wet day and looking towards the crowd and seeing your fellow Wolves in the stand cheering you on. It always gives me a little extra boost to keep pushing in the late game. It especially feels awesome when you make a good play and they get wild in the stands. But the Wolves community is special in the fact that we see each other in the halls of the college and everyone always smiles and waves towards each other. It makes my day a little bit better when I see a friendly face in the college. It is nice to see other athletes in the gym and catch up with them or even have them in your class. It is nice to go and support other teams as I know I get excited when they make a good play and the atmosphere gets wild whether in the gym or outside on the track. It is always nice to see how much every athlete in, this, in the college cares and, and is supportive of each other regardless of the sport. But overall, it is special how closely knit the athletic community is in GPRC. I think what makes being Wolf so special is the community support we have. Grand Prairie is a really, really supportive community and it's so evident when you go to the pitch, you go to the courts, the track, and we always have community members that are supporting us. I think that was especially evident this year when the cross country team hosted nationals. It was a really, really snowy day and it was cold and I didn't want to be out there, <laughs> but I had to be. And we had so many volunteers and the whole course was lined with spectators and that just made it all the more special. It wouldn't have been the same without the people of Grand Prairie. I just remember as I was going around my second or my third lap of the course at Nationals and I was dying. <laughs> it was very painful. Um, but I just couldn't stop because there are just so many people cheering and I'll never forget that feeling. I just felt like I was running for not just me, but, and not just my team, but everyone. And yeah, I will never forget it. It was a really, really special moment. And I think that a lot of athletes from GPRC can speak to that feeling. We don't play for ourselves, we play for the whole community and I think that's what makes the Wolves experience so special. So my experience at GPRC has been so much fun. Uh, I've created so many memories over the last three years and played with some really great guys, uh, very talented players, but you know, just made so many memories, whether that's the bus trips or close overtime wins, competing in practice, whatever it may be. It's been so much fun. Uh, I've been very honored to represent Grand Prairie and, and play in my hometown. 
I'm lucky that I got to finish my career off in the place that it all started. So I'm very, very grateful for the staff and coaches and trainers that we have um, in athletics. You guys make it really easy for us to want to go and compete every weekend and day in and day out and practice, workouts, whatever it may be. So um, unfortunately not coming back to play next year, but I'm excited to watch and cheer on from the sidelines. Um, yeah, that's about it for me. Hope everyone's doing well. Hello, I'd like to thank the administration staff uh, for the amazing job they have been doing. Well, I think administration is really important. And uh, without them, so, um, even though sometimes we don't notice, without them, uh, things would be impossible. Like, um, I know coaching is the core. So normally you see things like as coaching, instructing the core, but without the other pieces, um, like uh, registration, verification, scheduling, the other things would be impossible. Sometimes people don't realize that. So uh, I'd like to thank everybody in sports admin, um, not only Joanne, uh, Barb, Krista, Dwayne, Ron, everybody, Tom, everybody, everybody I'd like to thank. Thank you guys uh, for making this possible. Hello, Sam Tumai here, head coach GPRC men's volleyball team. From all the student athletes, coaches, athletic department, we want to express our thank you to all the GPRC staff in working together and helping the athletes and coaches throughout the season. Everyone's collaborations and active to recruiting, social media, guiding through courses administrations and and to the professors for their extra time in helping the athletes when we travel and also some extra time of learning. Previous season was a historical moment for GPRC Wolves providing a full-time coaching managing position. We as coaches are thankful for the opportunity to learn and to observe the collaborations within GPRC in person. In doing so, it allowed us athletes, coaches, and athletic departments to better and analyze the collaborating and the relationship to help the student athletes experience. Even now, when the situations are tough due to the global pandemic, it cannot be so clear to see your passion and your teamwork to providing the students the best chance to achieve. We also like to welcome new president Robert Murray, GPRC new leader and also supporter of the Wolves. We are looking forward to the direction that you're going to lead us during the time of uncertainty and we are all here behind with you. Once again, thank you so much, everyone. We are grateful to be a, a wolf and to be part of GPRC. Stay well. Good day, Wolves Nation. Um, I'm hoping everybody is uh, settling into whatever routine they have uh, heading into this, uh, I don't to call it off season, but uh, preparation for the fall, preparation for the season whatever they're gonna do this summer. Um, I really enjoyed the year. Uh, it was very different than in the past years. Uh, some of the teams I didn't work with at all, other teams I worked a great deal with, uh, but ultimately, no matter what, uh, when you join this, uh, this program, um, my thoughts, my heart, my hope is always uh, going out to you as, as far as competitive success, academic success, uh, and I hope people uh, continue to strive for that highest level of success that they possibly can achieve. Uh, the second thing that I really enjoyed was uh, the professional development opportunities with the coaches this year, uh, spending time with uh, with all of the coaches, looking in program development. Really, really enjoyed doing that this year. I had a lot of fun um, and hopefully uh, uh, there were a couple of things that the coaches could take away and incorporate their programs. 
Uh, I think the third thing, though, was uh, the individual stuff that I got to do this year. Um, in, in any athletes reaching out to me, any coaches reaching out to me specifically, um, and then really getting to understand and hopefully implore that with everyone that, you know, we're all human and uh, we all go through different things at different times and we experience different things in different ways. And so my role with, uh, with every single one of the, whether it was coaches, whether it was staff, whether it was uh, athletes individually, um, I really enjoyed the opportunity and I'm always humbled by the opportunity to participate. So thank you so much. Uh, I look forward to uh, hopefully continuing in the fall and uh, continue to raise those expectations. Uh, be great. Have a fantastic summer.